In the last few months, we got the idea to offer our Insider Club members an entry-level model, and we didn't have to think long about it. Our Insider Club members are not just people who want to get into the business, but people who want to get into the business. We wanted it to be something special. We wanted it to be something special. We wanted it to be something special. It is common knowledge that the metal housings for locomotives are produced at the Göppingen plant. They pass through a number of stations. Before they can be electroplated and then colored, the zinc die castings have to be brushed and deburred. This is done partly by hand, partly by a robot. In terms of strict quality control, however, the human eye is also needed. And so, Märklin employee Michel Richter not only takes one sharp look at the housings of a well-known locomotive family. The Trax family is a large locomotive family that includes several series, formerly from the company Bombardier, now Alstom. One of the best-known locomotive families in Era 6, because it can be seen in many countries throughout Europe. In Germany, it is very present because, among other things, the Deutsche Bahn AG ordered 400 examples, only of the class 185, the freight train variation. In addition, there were many variations for regional trains. The IC2 runs with locomotives from the Trax family, so it's a locomotive you can't get around. Red machines are nice to look at, but colorful locomotives attract everyone's attention. A locomotive owned by Deutsche Bahn AG was wrapped in a very colorful foil, based on the children's toy figure The Little ICE and His Friends. This is now a large and well-known animated program from the Deutsche Bahn AG. One of The Little ICE's friends is Günni. Günni is the big, strong freight train locomotive and Deutsche Bahn AG thought, why not turn a real locomotive into Günni? Back in September 2019, 185 367 went from being a normal draft horse to a jolly Gunny. The Deutsche Bahn AG locomotive with the road number 367 is allowed to run in Germany and Austria, and also travels near the border. It runs as far as Basel SBB and Aachen, and is completely on the road throughout Germany, from the Alps to the sea. If you just keep your eyes open, you will be able to see the Gunny live someday. It is the popular metal model, both the housing and the carrier are made entirely of metal. We have installed sound in the Gunny. It has 16 functions, including two additional functions. There are also many attached parts. The signal horns and handlebars on the fronts are all separately attached. On board is an MFX decoder, which means that the locomotive automatically sends a signal. We promptly did this with our first hand sample. Now it hauls a mixed freight train across the layout. Matching cars can certainly be found at every Märklin and Trix Havel friend. And those who still need them will certainly find them in the large Göppingen assortment. But now we'll let Gunny have his say. Also, ich sag ja immer, egal wie gut du bist, Gunny ist Güter. <laughs> The nice thing about Era 6 is that you can attach anything to it that's running around outside. The Deutsche Bahn AG variants run in both block train and single car service, which means that everything we have in the range, from tank cars to state cars to sliding wall cars, can be combined, mixed, or even used in block trains. 
The locomotive's color scheme is done in a combination of classic painting and digital printing technology. This means that the basic color scheme is applied using the classic painting process and the eye-catching advertising design on the sides and fronts is applied using high-quality digital printing. While Guni waits for an overhaul, he speaks up once again. Vorstellung von Günni Güterzug. Howdy da draußen. Ich bin der Günni. Wenn's was Schweres zu schleppen gibt, bin ich dein Mann. Egal ob Kohle, Stahl oder Apfelkompott, Günni liefert immer flott. <lacht> Now it's time for our freight train to move on to. With 185-367 accelerating its skew of cars true to the prototype. What else do we know about Guni? He prefers to travel with a long line of freight cars. What he likes least is having to drive alone. That goes without saying, doesn't it? The locomotive from the Trax family has long since become the mascot of DB Cargo. Guni is actually a fun toy figure from the little ICE family. My son is absolutely in love with Guni, and also with little ICE and his friends in general. And whenever we travel by long distance train on the ICE or the intercity, he always wants to get a figurine. This morning I took Guni out of his nursery. I have to bring him back tonight. I wanted to show that these toy figures exist, and the kids are crazy about them. It's wonderful. There are eight figures in total, including Grandpa Adler. Oh yes, the order deadline for the exclusive club model is the 15th of May 2023. Don't miss it, because you simply have to have the Guni locomotive.